Zoom announced today a brand new feature. It's the Zoom Mesh. It is an enterprise content delivery network that's going to save your reputation as well as your bandwidth. Stay tuned for the rest of the video because this is something you definitely want to know about. Zoom Mesh, it is an enterprise content delivery network. Like I said, it's going to save not only your reputation, but also your internet bandwidth. So let's go ahead and dig into it. So you might find yourself asking, what is an ECDN? An ECDN is an enterprise content delivery network. It is exactly what it sounds like. An enterprise content delivery network is an architecture that relieves bandwidth requirements for multiple concurrent sessions of real-time content and video delivery within a network. So let's say you're hosting a Zoom event or a Zoom webinar. Your panelists are recording their video and they are broadcasting that up through the cloud to Zoom. You have, let's say, three offices and each office is gonna have several users. We'll just say several. So your panelist is gonna be broadcasting to Zoom and then each user at each individual workstation is going to be pulling down a stream from Zoom for them specifically. This is going to take up a lot of bandwidth. How much bandwidth, you might ask? Well, let's do a little bit of math here. So we're gonna say a bandwidth for an enterprise with 2,000 uh, attendees on a Zoom event or Zoom webinar. So if your users are streaming at 720p and you have 2,000 users at 1.5 megabits per second, that's gonna come out to roughly three gigabits per second on your internet circuit. Now, say you wanted to go high definition, one stream at 1080p is roughly 2.5 megabits per second, which if you have 2,000 attendees, that's 5 gigabits per second. To put that into perspective, most offices will maintain between a 500 megabit per second and a 1 gigabit per second internet connection. And actually, the healthit.gov website actually only recommends that a hospital should only need about a 1 gigabit per second or a 1,000 megabit per second internet circuit. So what exactly does zoom mesh do how does this solve that problem well so again we have our panelists they're going to be connecting back to the zoom cloud you have your same offices your same attendees but this time we're going to add in the zoom mesh nodes now this time what's going to happen is your panelists are going to send their video to zoom zoom is then only going to send one stream to each office location that is going to go directly into your zoom mesh node at that office from there, within that network, the Zoom Mesh node will then deliver that content in real time to all panelists. So it's important to note what differentiates the Zoom Mesh from other ECDNs. Zoom tells us that with Zoom Mesh, we actually will maintain our original Zoom link, which other ECDNs don't offer that. We will also maintain all Zoom functionality for each participant, and that's the big one. So in traditional ECDNs, your participants, because it's going through an ECDN, will lose a lot of that functionality, such as chat or being able to raise their hands. They don't have that because you're going through a third-party ECDN. With Zoom Mesh, you're gonna maintain all that functionality. In today's video, we talked about the Zoom Mesh. It is a new ECDN offering directly from Zoom. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and please feel free to visit my website at www.colla.blog. That's Collablog. Well, that's the end of that. Zoom amount. Zoom amount. They amount it. <laughs> <laughs>